All right, I'm out at the range again this morning. I uh, brought in a new toy I picked up last weekend in a trade. It's a Ruger Mark III. It's got the bull barrel on it. The target sights, front and rear, adjustable. Um, haven't shot it yet. I've got, uh, right at the moment, I've already got four magazines loaded up with four different types of uh, ammunition. As you can see, it's got its own Picatinny rail. I haven't found a red dot yet. I don't know if I'm going to put one on. I'm going to try it. Since I haven't shot it, I'm going to try it out today and see how it shoots. I'm going to set some paper targets up out there. I've got some several different paper targets that I've uh, I actually just downloaded them from right there. They got several several different ones. If you got a printer at home, printers are pretty cheap. If you don't, steal the one at work and download you some. I think I did print some of these at work, but the colored ones I know I did at home. Because they don't use color paper at work. And I guess you can get pretty high tech with them if you got some better paper. Um, I'm going to stop, set up the tripod, and uh, we'll go over this a little bit, I think, first. Um, I traded this. I've been kind of eyeballing these for a whole year or so. I, January, I picked up that Chipawa. Not real happy with it. At the time, I thought, well, do I want the Ruger or do I want this? I also have been looking at the SR-22 uh, by Ruger. I'm a big Ruger fan. I got Ruger revolvers. Always enjoyed them. Never had many issues with them. Uh, the light's kind of hard to tell. But here on the uh, left panel is the uh, release right here for the slide. So it goes forward. The safety is back here. And the mag release right down here. Pretty much uh, same positions as your uh, 1911s. The grip, uh, it's on there somewhere. I think it says 22 slash 45. The grip is also the uh, same ergonomics as a 1911. Other than that, and having those three devices in the same thumb spacing, it really is nothing like a 1911. I wish we would just back off that one until they make a 1911 in the 22. They do make a 1911. Uh, they're pretty popular. I do see them at the gun shows. But this is nothing like the 45. I wish I'd just back off that one a little bit. It's a 22. Magazines are uh, metal, not plastic. Unlike the Chippewa magazine, the 10 rounds line up in there fairly nice. You don't see them staggered. You don't see them uh, double stacking in there. The magazine's got pretty good tolerance. Comes with a little loading device. I didn't need it. If you drop the rim down in the center there, it drops right in. Just hold the thumb deal down. Alright, I'm going to stop, set the camera up, and uh, staple a target up. 